so the next component that we'll be looking at will be the card so what is a card in the material ui so a card is a surface that displays the content and actions onto a single topic and the content can contain different images it can be a heading it can be any action buttons on just a single topic and all like a blog post so if we see a blog post now you can see this is an instagram blog post now you can see these are the header of the card this is the avatar image on the card and these are the options which can be action area and this is the image that can be inside the card and then you can see these are again the action buttons these are again the like comment and the send buttons and these are the save buttons and then you have some card action area you have the caption area you have the caption and then you have the comment area so this is just a single card which can have so much of content inside that which can have heading images and captions and so many things and then the card have multiple components to complete just a card so in material ui the card has the multiple components it have a card header it has the avatar it have the action area which we can click and it can have so many things so now we can see the properties of what are the properties onto the card so the first property that can have is the max width so to define the maximum width of the card to make it a responsive we need to specify the max width property inside the card and then we can have some additional properties like sx for the design and for the styling and then we can have a classes to change the pre-default size of the card so now we can see about the card by going to the card component inside the material ui so you can see about the card so this is the component api so these are the props like it can have a children notes it can have a classes it can have the sx and all of the things and now you can see the demo of the card as well by going to the demo so now you can see the cards contain a content and actions about just a single subject and they are just the surfaces that displays the content and actions onto just a single topic so now you can see this is a simple card that we know so this is the card and then you can see we have the action button as well now you can see this is an outlined card and now you can see this is again a complex interaction card now you can see we have some options and this card is like just an instagram post now you can see we have some options we have the avatar image we have the header we have like description or we can have a location there in the card header and then we have the text and then we have the like and the share buttons and even we can just extend this card as well so this is a very big card so this is looking very good so these are about the cards and now you can see you can have the media inside the cards like you can see example of an card using an image and then you can see you have so many cards like you can see you have again another card with just a same card and then you can see you have some different action buttons and now you can see you can have the primary action buttons now you can see this is a clickable card and then you can see you have more cards like you can see this is also a card with the description and it is fully clickable and then you can see it have some action buttons as well so these are the cards like you can see a music player can also have a card with some three icons and then image and then it can have the description and it can have the heading so these are all about the cards so now we can just grab any card and we can just build that card so now you can see this card is looking good so we can just grab this card so we need to just move on to the source code and now you can see we have the card so this is the main card components now you can see this is the card so as we have discussed the card can have the multiple components so we can have a card action area which is the action area which can be a clickable so this is also an action area and then you can see inside the action area the first is the card media which is the media of the card like you can see this is the media which can be an image and after the media that we have the card content so about the content then we have the typography and typography has the lizard inside that like you can see this is a lizard after the image and then you can see we can have again the typography with the variant of the body 2 and then we have different color of that typography and then we have the lizards and then we have the caption of that card like you can see here we have the caption again on the card and then you can see after that all done after the card action area is also completed so we have just closed the action area as well and then you can see we again have the card actions and the actions can have the action buttons there like you can see we have the share we can have a like button as well we can have a comment button we can have a share button as well so now you can see so this all makes a card so this is all about the card so now we can just grab this card and we can just move on to the visual studio code to try out this card so we can just paste this card inside the visual studio code now i have not pasted it and now we need to import everything from there so this is a card we need to import and then we need to import the card action area as well and the card media as well and then we need to import the card content as well and then we need to import the typography as well and then we need to import the card actions here as well and the button as well 
so now all of the things are now imported and now we can just use the card so if i will now just save it if i will now move on to the application like now you can see now we have the card and now you can see this is a clickable card and the image is not coming because the image is the static image which is provided onto the web page so we can just go and we can just grab any image and then we can just add the url of that image inside this card so i have now grabbed a url of the image so if i will now just save if i will now just run the application once again now you can see now we have the different image onto the card and now we can just change the description as well as a visit to london and we can change the typography as well so we can just stick to that and now you can say we have the buttons as well of the share and we can have some more buttons as well like we can have the save as well so if i will now save so now you will see we have the share and the save buttons inside that so this is about the card that we can use and about the max width property inside this card so we can just change the max width as well so it can be a 345 and it can be a 500 as well to increase the width of the card now you can see the width of the card has also been increased so this is all about the cards inside the material ui and after that now you can just move on to the react card component and you can just try other cards as well like this like you can see this is an instagram type card so you can just grab this card as well and you can just grab these icons as well and the icons we will learn about the icons later with the mui icons which the material ui provides so this is all about the cards inside the material ui